Um, so Tony Abbott hasn't been uh, saying or doing or seemingly doing all that much. It's been a slow start. Is he getting tougher and um, acting more now, uh, John Roskam? Uh, he's had the bonfire of the 92 taxes, uh, an axe on 20 various government bodies that seem like the National Steering Committee on Corporate Wrongdoing and the Antarctic right. Animal Ethics Committee. How can we Very do without valid. them? How can we do without them? I don't know. Uh, do you think he's finally doing stuff? The Abbott government is starting to do a lot of things, but I'm not sure that it's gone far enough. Even though he's axed some of Labor's taxes, there are still a number of taxes that he is proceeding with. The excise on tobacco, for example, he's still taking people's bank accounts after three years when they've been inactive. This is only a start. Look, it might be great for the penguins in Antarctica, but there's a lot of other regulations Renewable to go. Renewable energy target is still there. And exactly, and we still have a lot of money wasted and we still have power prices going up because of exactly, as you say, the renewable energy targets. That should be the first thing to go, not the last. Well, uh, look, I think there is that, John Roskam. The, the, there are signs of strife here, and I don't see the frantic activity from this government uh, to, to match the, the challenge that we face. Now, there are two big questions that this government will have to answer, I think, before Christmas. And one is, uh, do they keep propping up the car industry, uh, particularly with Holden threatened to pull out? Two, uh, will allow an American company to buy the grains handler Grain Corp, which are the nationals are adamant about. How big are those two challenges? These are important issues that could define the Abbott government's first oh. term. Absolutely. Tony Abbott has said Australia is open for business. We must be. Australia needs foreign investment. Uh, Holden can't take any more taxpayers' money, as difficult as it is. What we need to do is find new jobs for these people. Uh, and in relation to Grain Corps, we need the foreign investment. Joe Hockey has to stare down the nationals and say we welcome investment. Well,